be less awkward. <laughs> Welcome back to our YouTube channel, Danny's People Do Things. This is Danny. I'm Samantha. And I'm Chad. And currently, we are taking a weekend trip to the Rockies and we're going to do some day hikes and hopefully share them all with you. So, currently, we are on Taylor Lake. We're halfway to the lake right now. So, uh, and it's taking us an hour to get there and it's warming up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! Okay. I think that was important time to tell you it's minus 15 right now. It's cold. A little trail maintenance for the Rooney. Poor girl always gets some snow in her paws. But we've been hiking for an hour, so this isn't too bad. Hey, stop. 
another three kilometers to go. This is a kilometer bit away. <laughs> How far? Uh, 2.1 kilometers left to the lake. It is currently 12.20. So, downside of the trail, if there is a downside, there's all these trees. But what that does mean is on a Saturday in the Rockies on a very gorgeous day, we're the only ones on here. I'm okay with that. We are currently at the part of the trail where Chad's feet are too big. Come on, let's go, Danny. We are just leaving Taylor Lake now. And nine kilometers, apparently, is what it took us to get here. Not 6.3. Time to head down. We are just about done. You might be able to hear some traffic in the background. We have about a kilometer left before we're back into the parking lot. Apparently there's still squirrels around. Um, 
Yeah, it was nine kilometers in versus the 6.2 that we expected. Granted, it was a GPS, so we still to confirm. But uh, it would have been nice to know. We would have planned a little bit differently for an 18 kilometer day versus a 12. Regardless, the views were amazing up there. And there's a campsite, which we will plan on coming back to in the summer or early fall. Definitely. Yeah. And there's a couple day hikes too, it looks like you can do around Taylor Lake. All in all, this is a great hike to do and um, just be prepared for slightly more kilometers. Hi, and welcome to our day two of our weekend hiking trip. We're currently on the Lake Agnes Trail to the tea house uh, that starts at Lake Louise. And right now we're at the halfway point. And we are at a great viewpoint and we have a Fairview Mountain this way. And behind us, we have the Big Beehive, which are both accessible to hike. In the winter time. Well, you can do more outdoor in the summer. It's, they're uh, they're day hikes. You can, they're they're mountains you can climb. So this is how it is the entire way. Uphill though. So we're about 400 meters from the Lake Agnes Tea House. A big beehive, also called the Devil's Thumb. You can see why they call it a thumb. Another view of Fairview Mountain. And we're by ourselves. So we're actually currently standing on Lake Agnes. And if you're ever here in the summer, you'll know this place is crazy. But currently we're here with maybe nine other people on a Sunday, which is safe to say does not happen too often. We have Danny hating the snow-covered steps. You got this, girl. You got this, girl. It's okay, honey. You can do it. Yeah. I'll get some treats out for you. You'll do anything for treats. Yeah. What's this? Look, Danny. Oh. Come on. What's this? Yeah, good job, Danny. Is she stepping oh. on her leash? Yeah, okay. Come on, Rooney. Up, going up is way easier. You can go on your tiptoes. 
Yeah. Maybe just take her leash <coughs> off, yeah, for this <coughs> part. <laughs> I don't know how else you think you're gonna get down, Danny. Oh, yeah, come on. Okay, she's kidding, she's fine. <laughs> Good job, Danny. Thanks. Thanks for doing it a second time. <laughs> Sun is coming up. So this little path here takes you up to a little beehive. We've done it before. Maybe we'll stitch something in. Or not. We've done it in the winter once. It's okay, okay. to not do it again. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's all right. It has really good views of Lake Louise in the winter, or just always. But yeah, really Chateau de Lake Louise. Come on, Danny. Where are I think Danny wants the views. You want to do it? No, I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I'm So we are going down uh, from our Lake Agnes hike, heading back to Lake Louise. Yes. Um, definitely a busier winter hike, but would recommend it in the winter, not the summer. Yeah, definitely a nice, nice little winter hike. It's a well-packed trail too, so and well-maintained. So you're not going to be stepping over any deadfall. Views are definitely worth it. And the trail's wide enough to pass people. Yeah. Like, to intersect, intersect? Like, yeah, anyways, to pass people. And this was a Sunday, and I think we ran into like maybe six groups today. So. Be a lot faster, our dog didn't sniff everything, but we're having a good time. We're standing here on the shores of Lake Louise, just finished our Lake Agnes hike, our day two of our weekend winter getaway. We did Taylor Lake yesterday, Agnes Lake today. They are both wonderful winter hikes. You don't see as many people and it's a different feel because now you're getting the snow and the frozen lakes and the frozen waterfalls. So it's really cool. We would highly recommend it. Uh, if you liked this video, Please like it down and below and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much.